Hello, Grace and friends. It's Mrs. Worman with another story for you today. This story is Duck for President by Doreen Cronin. Here we go. Running a farm is very hard work. At the end of each day, Farmer Brown is covered from head to toe in hay, horsehair, seeds, sprouts, feathers, filth, mud, muck, and coffee stains. He doesn't smell very good either. He is tired and look, you can tell that you don't smell good when even the pigs are making faces. The animals have chores to do too. Their sign says, pigs clean under the beds, cows weed the garden, sheep sweep the barn, duck take out the trash, mow the lawn, grind coffee beans. At the end of each day, the pigs are covered in dust bunnies the cows are covered in weeds. The sheep are covered in dust. There they all are. And duck is covered in tiny bits of grass and espresso beans. Espresso is a kind of coffee. Duck did not like to do chores. He did not like picking tiny bits of grass and espresso beans out of his feathers. Why is Farmer Brown in charge anyway, thought Duck. What we need is an election. He made a sign and hung it up in the barn. It says, Farmer Brown must go. Farm election tomorrow. The next morning, Farmer Brown found a poster on his front door. It says, vote Duck for a kinder, gentler farm. Farmer Brown was furious. He ran to the barn and found the animals registering to vote. The sign duck hung up says, voter registration. Voters must live on the farm, show valid ID, be at least this tall. The mice got together and protested the height requirement. So duck crossed it off. On election day, each of the animals filled out a ballot and placed it in the box. The vote was counted and the results were posted on the barn wall. Farmer Brown, six, Duck, 20. It seems like Duck won by a lot. Farmer Brown demanded a recount. One sticky ballot was found stuck to the bottom of a pig. The new tally was Farmer Brown, six, Duck, 21. The voters had spoken. Duck was officially in charge. He looks very pleased with himself. Running a farm is very hard work. At the end of each day, duck was covered from head to toe in hay, horsehair, seeds, sprouts, feathers, filth, mud, muck, and coffee stains. Running a farm is no fun at all thought Duck. That one makes me laugh because on the list of things he's covered with every day, it says seed sprouts feathers. He's covered in feathers every day. Just a, just a little thing I noticed. <laughs> that night, Duck and his staff started working on Duck's campaign for governor. The signs say, vote for me, I'm a duck not a politician. Duck left Farmer Brown in charge and hit the campaign trail. He visited small town diners. He marched in parades. Those signs say, vote duck, vote for me, a duck, not a politician. He went to town meetings he gave speeches that only other ducks could understand. On election day, the voters filled out their ballots in booths all over the state. The vote was counted and the results were posted in the local paper. The headline is, duck wins by a nose. 
Ms. Governor, 299,999 votes. Duck, 300,000 votes. How big is the difference between those two? Just one vote. The governor demanded a recount. Two sticky ballots were found stuck to the bottom of a plate of pancakes. Good thing the horse was looking for them. The new tally was Ms. Governor, 299,999. Duck, 300,002. The voters had spoken. Duck was officially in charge. I like that he found extra votes again and they were both for him. Running a state is very hard work. At the end of each day, Duck was covered from head to toe in hairspray, ink stains, scotch tape, fingerprints, mayonnaise, and coffee stains. And he had a very bad headache. Running a state is no fun at all, thought Duck. That night, Duck and his staff started working on posters for the presidential election. They say, a duck for a change. I like Ike, and that's crossed out. It says, I like duck. And then duck, working, oops, making us proud again. I have to read this backwards when I look in the screen, so I'm sorry, I made a little mistake. And the I like Ike one, there used to be a president named Eisenhower and his signs in when he was campaigning to be president said, I like Ike. Duck left his staff in charge and hit the campaign trail. He kissed babies in local diners. He rode in parades. That part does look like fun. He gave speeches that only ducks could understand. He even played the saxophone on late night television. On election day, the voters filled out their ballots in booths all over the country. The vote was counted and the results were announced on CNN. It says, Decision America, Miss President, Mr. President, 50,546,165. Duck, 50,546,170. Duck defeats President. The president demanded a recount. 10 sticky ballots were found stuck to the bottom of the vice president. The new tally was Mr. President, 50,546,165. 50, duck, 50,546,170. Ike, 50,546,180. The voters had spoken. Duck was officially in charge. Again, all the votes that they found at the recount were all for Duck. <sighs> Running a country is very hard work. At the end of each day, Duck was covered from head to toe in face powder, paper cuts, staples, secret service agents, and coffee stains. And he had a very bad headache. Running a country is no fun at all, thought Duck. Then he checked the help wanted ads. Duck needed, no experience necessary, must be able to mow the lawn and grind coffee beans. Duck left the vice president in charge and headed back to the farm. At the end of each day, Farmer Brown is now covered from head to toe in hay, horse hair, seeds, sprouts, feathers, Filth, mud, muck, and coffee stains. And Duck is working on his autobiography. He's writing a book about himself. An autobiography means a book about himself. In fact, he has some famous lines already written on the computer screen. It says, Four score and seven years ago, 
that is something President Lincoln said a long time ago. So he crossed it off and wrote something else. The only thing we have to fear is fear. That is something that another president said a long time ago. And ask not what your country. That is something another president said a very long time ago. So it says instead, running a farm is very hard work. The end. Look at Duck. That is a big campaign rally with balloons and signs. That looks like fun. All of those jobs are very hard work, I think. And I don't think Duck appreciated that until he had to do them. Sometimes that happens. You don't really appreciate something till you try it. And then you say, oh my, that is hard actually. I hope you liked our story today. I really love reading to you every single time I have a chance. It's one of my favorite things. I hope you have a great day and I will see you next time. Goodbye.